Welcome back to 7 Days to Die, Alpha 19.4. This is a little bit of a let's have a, let's have a laugh um, video. Basically what I've done is I've created a 5x5 wooden block and I've created a 9x9 wooden block. And I want to see how much damage the demolitioner does if you shoot, if he blows up on that. Hmm. Bit more difficult to hit. Ah, there we are. Let's see what happens. Whoa. He actually blew all the way into the 9x9 nine nine block and he was standing seven blocks away from that block that was damaged over there. So let's go and clean that up and just repatch now let's see what happens with this zombie whoa he does quite a bit of damage he actually blew out an area wider than four on either side of him but he did the same over here because there was three blocks and two spaces so he blew out an area five wide so what I'm going to do is I'm going to build a block that is ten wide on either side and we'll come back to this in a moment after the previous two tests I decided maybe bigger is better in this case so what I've done is I've created a 15 by 15 block so he, the zombie is surrounded or the demo is surrounded by seven blocks of wood on all sides of the, of the block that he's actually standing on. Let's see if we can trigger him. Mm, that looked like a dead on shot and it didn't trigger. Okay, there we are. Let's see what happens. Okay, we don't seem to have got an exact effect, but he's actually blown out five blocks on the right hand side, five blocks above him, and it looks like Let's go and measure up exactly to get a better idea. Only two blocks below himself. So the demo radius actually seems to have some type of RNG built into it. And blows are, uh, blowing them around around it over there. Okay, this was just a short short video on the de uh, on on basically the demo radius and the just for laughs to see exactly what would happen if we built a wooden frame and put the demo in the center and let him blow up. Thank you for watching this video, and if you enjoyed it, leave a like. And I'll see you in the next one.